name. We're gonna I take. Forgot. We're gonna take. Oh, I can't remember his name in the movie is, but we're gonna just trip balls. All right, and the last two things we'll talk about right here before we go is Monty Williams was fired, and they have now announced that Kevin Young, Nick Nurse, Mike Boonholzer, and Kevin Young's a young guy who's like 36 or 38 or 40 years old. He's the head assistant coach for the Suns. Big fan. Like he's like a, referred to like the Knicks Will Hardy of the NBA. And then you got Mike Budenholzer and Nick Nurse who have been announced. Then you have Ty Lu and Monty Williams now on the the Bucks radar as well as the Pistons are supposedly going to hire our man Kevin Ollie. But let's talk Ty about Lue? Ty Lu's not leaving the Clippers, man. Ty Lu's being targeted by the Bucks for a trade. Oh, they're going to dock it? And Jason Kidda. Oh, my God. Sean Payton. Sean Payton, it, yeah. Sean Payton, it too, yeah. I mean, interesting. Interesting. I mean, it all depends on what they give up because, like, Doc got, like, a first-round pick. Can we agree Monty place. Williams was the most insane firing? I felt – but that was just because new owner wants his guy. But it's I new owner wanting his will... guy. He wants to clean the Robert Sarva era completely up. Yeah. Which is fair because everything just... that Robert Sarver touched – just turned to shit. But James Jones is one of the best executives, so you can't fire James Jones. Well, yeah, but, like, everybody else is fair game. Yeah. Like, the Robert Sarver era in Phoenix is done. They're going to finally get a G League team because their owner isn't cheap enough to not want to fund one. So, like... Uh, I see to be... sold on Monty Williams being a good coach. I just think he was the most shocking firing. I didn't expect it. was the NBA Finals a couple of years ago. Yeah, they, lost, it, they lost in the second round. Back Coach back Bud season. Coach Bud was a little bit more surprising because, like, he won a championship a few years ago. Monty Williams, would you rather – okay, we saw we saw DeAndre Ayton in the final year do really solid for him. I would rather keep DeAndre Ayton at the helm than get rid of DeAndre Ayton because him and Monty don't work. Like, would, you so- rather have, would you rather have Monty Williams or Bud? Bonnie Bud Williams for sure. Yeah. Wow. I don't think Bud should have been fired. Uh, I think Bud, Bud won a championship. Won. Bud won a championship. Bud won a championship. But the, but the same but problem. Lost to the Miami Eaton. Sure. Bud he has, didn't win a championship. Bud, Bud got fired for the same reasons that he got fired from Atlanta. He sucks at in-game adjustments. Uh, I'm telling you, the reason. Yeah, it's like so Doc. Was Monty Williams. Bud, Bud got fired. Yeah. Bud won a so championship Monty. because of Giannis. Bud won yeah. a championship because of Monty Giannis. Had, but anybody Monty had – Monty Williams arguably had a better Suns team this year, like on paper, than like any team that like Bud had. He had no Kevin depth. Durant, Kevin Durant. I know they didn't have enough depth, but like Monty Williams has coached a lot more great players than Bud. So like I, Bud was, in my opinion, the most surprising fire because like he won a championship. You'd think that a bottom some goodwill, but I guess not. I get right, Tyloo immediately. If you so, can get Tyloo immediately, yeah. you get him. Yeah. I don't think Monty Williams is that bad. I think the Suns, like, you, you trade your whole entire bench. It sucks for yeah. Monty Williams. Like, that, yeah, the whole Monty Williams is a bad coach is a bullshit take. That's, mm. That sucks. Fuck the NBA. Just- I think Monty Williams is a good coach. I think Bud, like, but the problem with Bud is no, like, and the same thing. I think Monty Williams and Nick Nurse have been two guys who've been slandered. And they got fired because of, like, they're not the ones who constructed the rosters. They just coached the rosters. And they're getting flack for like not yeah, being able to coach a I flawed mean, roster. Fault they have no bench. And it's, yeah, they had both had flawed rosters, and they're like, Why the Suns made fight? short-sighted moves, thinking that getting star power alone was going to help their team get better. Like it's not Monty's fault, but like at the end of the day, someone's got to go down. So I'm surprised the fact that all these other teams have fired their coaches, and the Hornets still have Steve Clifford. I know, but that's because I don't think anybody wants the Hornets job. Oh, fuck no. Everyone like, nobody that. wants that fucking job. Nobody wants to work in that cancer of an organization. All uh, right. You could say you could have said the same thing about the Suns before Monty got there. Like, the oh, Suns, yeah. are, the Suns yeah. are under Robert Sarver. The Suns were a train wreck, and nobody wanted to work there. Until they This is the same owner. That was 